All right, what's going on everybody? This is gonna be a really quick tutorial on how to do custom resolutions for AMD video cards with the Radeon settings. Um, we're gonna be focusing on H1Z1 in this video. So uh, let's get to it. So we're gonna to go to our program files where H1Z1 is located. So it's on my SSD uh, program files. It's in Steam. And then we're gonna to go to Steam apps and then call common and then h1z1 king of the kill now we're going to scroll down to user options um it should open up as a notepad now right here this is where you input your custom resolution so right now we're doing 1440 by 900 resolution um let's see make sure these are set to full screen because you can only use custom resolutions in full screen mode. Uh, it doesn't work in window borderless. It'll look funky. Uh, trust me. It'll literally be a weird box on your screen. So we're going to put that to full screen, everything to full screen. And the window width and window height doesn't really matter. It's what we're focused on right here is our full screen width. So we're putting 1440 by 900. Now we're going to exit out and it's going to ask you to save and do your save. Now, if you want your settings to, to save and to save, you can put this to read only. So if you're ever in H1 Z1 settings, like the in game settings, uh, and you change a whole bunch of stuff, um, it won't save. So the next time you open up the game, uh, those settings that you just set won't be saved and it'll be your original default settings whatever in there so we're gonna leave that to we're gonna unclick read only just because uh i like my crosshairs change my crosshairs back and forth so anyways uh once we're done with that we have our custom resolution set for h on z1 now we're gonna go to our radeon settings this is our radeon uh you know graphics card settings so what we're going to go to is display. And since I have two monitors, uh, my main monitor I game on is my display too. So we're going to make sure this is on preserve aspect ratio. And then it's going to have custom resolutions set down here. So we're going to go create. I already created my 1440 by 900. So I'm going to show you how to do it first of all. And display two is what we're playing on. Display two. So right here, it's gonna let you put in your custom resolution. We're gonna put 1440 by 900. Okay, we're gonna leave it like that. And then on your timing standard, we're not gonna leave it on manual. We're gonna put it to CVT, CVT. It's gonna set our uh, our H timing, our H display and our H timing, or V timing display to the same as our custom resolution. And then we're gonna play safe or click save it's gonna uh configure your monitors real quick so it's gonna go black and then go come back on now we're gonna run since our custom resolution's down there we can exit out of this we can open up h1c1 okay give it a second okay um monitor is gonna go black for a second or uh the video give it a second okay we're loading up h on z1 all right now if you get a uh random box on your screen if you get a random box on your screen here let me see let me see if you can actually see it here, i'm gonna show you guys i'm gonna show you guys what happened like uh what it looks like oh what did i do okay there it goes um if you get a random box on your screen of the game like in the top left corner uh of your monitor just press alt enter until you go to full screen uh it should work like that so all right so we're in game this is our 1440 by 900 custom resolution